Hi, Larry Gaines, Power Cycle Trading. In this video, I wanted to show you a trade setup on Apple uh, using a um, credit spread. Uh, credit spreads are one of my favorite strategies. They can be used in any kind of market environment, and currently we're in a very volatile market. So I like trade setups that are very structured with defined risk, and credit spreads offer uh, a really great um, strategy in order to take advantage of trades with uh, low cost and defined risk. So let me show you this trade set up on Apple uh, that was from this week, uh, put on January the 28th. So basically, you know, Apple came out with earnings the 27th, had just fantastic blowout earnings, popped, you know, to the upside, had a nice gap up. Now, the high probability when, when you have a big gap up is that the market will fall through to the upside. And also, Apple after earnings tends to have a, tends to have a, a seasonal trend in the direction of its earnings. So, the trade setup I was looking for was on any kind of pullback to get in on a credit spread. So I'll show you the trade setup on uh, this particular uh, Apple, uh, and this was based on weekly options put on on the 28th to expire on Friday the 30th. So in this trade. It was just basically selling the 116 strike, buying the 115 on the puts. So uh, Apple, uh, you know, was trading uh, at about 115.90. So this was a little bit in the money, and you know, received a credit of 53 dollars, max loss 47. So nice positive risk reward, very small capital exposure here. So this trade was put on the 28th and it was based for expiration on the 30th and all it needed to do was close above 116 keep that full $53 that's over 100 percent return uh, and a very small account can be used for this as well as a big account so nice trade setup hope this helps talk to you on the next update